The Huntress is a fictional short story by Sophia Samatar that touches on topics of fear, family, and identity. The award-winning author from Virginia, United States, creates intriguing, heart-pumping, and blood-boiling literary pieces, and The Huntress is not exception. The story discovers the need for adventure and magic within the human body, which is evident in children but fades away with time. It also represents the reason why people choose to travel and visit new places and countries. Although fictional, the huntress is a metaphor for human fear and its necessity in the life and sustainability of societies. Samatar's work is amazingly descriptive and imaginative, yet relevant to any reader, creating an engaging and mysterious atmosphere. The first two lines of the story, in which Samatar writes that she is the only person not hiding in the town, depict the desire for individuality and bravery that every individual contains. However, right after, readers learn that it is due to her unawareness as a non-local. These lines have a dual meaning and can be interpreted as a reinforcement for the burden of knowledge. The more a person knows, the more responsibility and fear they gain. On the other hand, children and those who lack awareness tend to be happier and less stressed than others, looking for a new experience and ready to experiment. Often, people turn back to their early childhood full of excitement and joy as they travel to new countries because they face a new world in which they can fearlessly discover their surroundings once again. The Huntress later represents different human responses to their fears. While some take shelter in their cellars and under their beds, others get driven by increasing adrenaline and the heat of moments full of risks. Samatar goes on to search for the reasons behind it, referring to the past and the feelings associated with it. As she faces the huntress, who leaves stains on the roofs, the situation reminds her of her father and her youth. Then, the huntress turns into a tenor lion, though she can be any other as this is only Samatar's association, fueled by memories of childhood and family. These lines imply that people transform into a different self, which is a combination of their past, family, and emotions. The huntress is also a representation of contemporary society. As she refers to monks, who abstract themselves from feelings and emotions, Samatar speaks of the current pursuit of happiness, which is tightly intertwined with fear. She says, I'm an American, so she has to look for happiness and safety, and she must be afraid of the huntress that can take everything from her. The world is full of instructions and limitations, which require people to shut down, close their windows, and hide under their beds. However, when they face their fears aggressively and bravely, they can escape from such a controlling environment. Although The Huntress is a fictional short story by an award-winning author Sophia Samatar, it is a great representation of contemporary society and the human soul. The story discovers common fears and temptations, which cause communities to close down. Samatar implies that sometimes individuals should turn back to their childhoods and become fierce once again. Then, the huntress will stop feeding, leading to an independent and brave leaving. This and many other essays are available at studycorgi.com.